بسم الله الرحمن الرحیم We begin in the name of God the infinitely compassionate the infinitely merciful and with the breath we open to the presence of Al-Latif the infinitely subtle one Ya Latif, O oh, most mysteriously subtle in presence and gently kind. Ya Habir, O oh, all aware. Ya Sami, O oh, all hearing one. Ya Basir, O oh, all seeing one. Ya Kudus, O oh, most holy and pure. Ya Nur, O oh, you who are light of the heavens and the earth. Ya Wadud, O infinitely loving one. Ya Latif, Ya Habir, Ya Nur. Beloved one, heal our ills. Each one of us has a journey toward greater health with you, listening deeply to your songs, vibration redirects, our neuropathways realign, empty of our own recordings, we turn afresh to the silence that holds all sound, and wait for your whales and dolphins to share their chants from underwater realms in the vast sea of your being. Beloved friends gather in the sunshine by the shore where air meets water and earth and your messages arrive with the tides within our hearts. We smile enlivened by your sweet radiance. Ya Latif, Ya Khabir, Ya Sami, Ya Basir, Ya Kudus, Ya Nur, Al Samawati Wal Ard. And truly, this is a message for all the worlds. Inner and outer, dance in your love. O oh, most subtle of mysteries, Ya Latif, Ya Wadud. And from the Quran, Surah 67, verses 13 and 14. And whether you hide your word or declare it, he, she certainly knows the secrets of hearts. Should he, she not know? He, she who created. And he, she is the most subtle and the one who is aware of everything. From Surah 12, Ayat 100. Truly, my sustainer is subtle beyond comprehension in whatever he she wills. Truly, he she alone is all-knowing, all-wise. From Surah 31, verses 16 and 17, the prayer of the Prophet Luqman. O oh, my dear son, truly, though there be anything but the weight of a mustard seed, and though it be hidden in a rock, or in the skies, or in the earth. God will bring it to light. For behold, God is subtle in mystery, all aware. O oh, my dear son, be constant in prayer and enjoying the doing of what is right and forbid the doing of what is wrong and bear in patience whatever 
may befall you. This, behold, is something upon which to set one's heart. From Surah 7, verses 204 to 205. Say, I follow what is revealed to me by my sustainer. This revelation is a means of insight from your sustainer and a guidance and grace to those who will have faith. And so when the Quran is voiced, pay attention and listen in silence so that you might be graced with God's mercy. And remember your sustainer humbly within yourself and with awe. And without raising your voice in the morning and in the evening. And don't allow yourself to be unaware. From Surah 31, verses 30 to 31. God alone is the Most High, the Most Great. Aren't you aware how the ships speed through the sea by God's favor? so that he, she might show you some of his her wonders. Herein, behold, there are messages indeed for all who were wholly patient in adversity and deeply grateful. And from Surah 24, verse 35. God is the light of the heavens and the earth. And from Surah 38, verses 87 to 88. This is no less than a reminder to all the worlds. And after a while, you will know its meaning. And from the Bible, Ecclesiastes 3, verse 1. To everything there is a season and a time to every purpose under heaven.